Hey there guys, Neil here, back with an, or back with a game review to have proper grammar, but for today's game review, I'll be reviewing a game, a game that was recently released for Android and iOS called Star Wars Puzzle Droids. So, if you're a fan of games like Bejeweled or Star Wars uh, games, then Puzzle Droid may be the game for you. So, basically the game is set in the Star Wars universe around the time of The Force Awakens. You're taking on uh, the character of BB-8, um, who has lost his memory, and you need to help collect circuits to help him get his memory back. You start off with help from C-3PO, and along the way you'll get help from... Or meet up with other characters like Poe Dameron and Rey, so um, there's a little there's a lot of um, movie tie-ins there as well. Um, I'll cover the settings uh, pretty quickly because there are not too much to go through. So you have your usual sound controls, music, voiceovers, and quality of games. So it was set to low, but I'll set it up to high um, just to, for the sake of the review. Um, and once you jump into it, you get the usual things like tips. And progress reports as well. So currently uh, we're on um, Jakku. But you can go on to Takodana. I think that's where Maz's castle is. The Death Star. Um, and I, I guess there's going to be more add-ons. Or there might be more add-ons later. So uh, we'll continue on the uh, game in the game with Jakku. So um, we're in some of the ruins. Um, so I need to collect 27 of these green triangles and uh, we'll go from there and then each game each level has various um goals or different goals that you need to uh, um accomplish to move on and um you get various other tips as well when you first start playing the game so get five in a straight line for emp so um they give you the um uh, tips in uh, live interactions on how to do that um so with that, we'll jump, or I'll jump right into it. So um, I'm gonna mash some of these up as I go, see what I can um, come up with, and um, see where we, where I land at the end of the level. So um, obviously, I need to get go for green triangles. Um, I don't have, or I, as I'm talking and playing as we go, and um, so there's that as well. So. Um, match those up and get as many done as possible and then you also have various things like um try or not just straight lines but you can do angles and various other things as well so um if you want to if you want to get other power-ups and things like that then that is also an option so i've completed all the circuits and um is completing everything else as well so i get a higher score um so when it finishes, I guess it'll move on and let me play into the next level. And basically that's the whole purpose of the game. So if you have played games like Bejeweled or I guess Candy Crush is the same way, then um, it'll be pretty easy to uh, jump right into the game. And then um, as you get those various circuits, then it'll let you know um, exactly what you need to do. And I guess the high setting is too high for my uh, phone. So now that I have 200 um, coins, then um i can see what kind of what i need to do so use memory disk to do that so i'll hit the back button i'm gonna set the settings i'll set it to medium see if um that's a little bit better and then i'll hit go and play one more level but you get the gist of it it's a pretty straightforward game um as you collect various or as you accomplish various goals get like points get coins then you get various um, benefits by doing that, and it's all in the purpose of helping BB-8 regain his memory. So, um, overall, pretty fun game. Um, and then I guess you can combine uh, multiple power-ups to do more uh, things, all the or accomplish more things as well. So, um, I guess I need to collect 80 of those uh, things and I can sw swap two special circuits to combine them for a bigger special effect. So um, they have all sorts of power-ups and things as well. So um, something to uh, look forward to in the game and um, accomplish various things in the game. So um, let's... Or I'll pl continue playing that. I get don't know why it wants me to swap that but um let's try swapping that a little bit see what 
um, or in using power-ups there as well, so accomplish that. Get all of that done, so he's, as you can see, it's helping me accomplish a lot of the level all at once. Um, and I guess you do have a limited number of moves to um, um, that you have to finish it in, so there is that um, accomplishment as well to consider. So let's do that, get that done. Um, get do that as well, see how get or see where that sets me up at um let's see what else can i do i can probably do that so i mean it's pretty so yeah basically it comes down to it's um pretty straightforward if you've played games like it, this before then you kind of know what you're getting yourself into so um there's not too much that you have to really uh learn or uh get used to or anything like that if you haven't the the steps are very very straight are helpful and straightforward and um easy to um follow so you can get right into the gist of the game and uh, finish the various levels so finish the level have 12 moves to go so um that's pretty much it so that's pretty much the gist of the review so the game is available for android ios our Android and iOS is available in the Apple App Store, uh, Google Play, and the Amazon App Store. So if you have, um, I will assume that if you have a Fire um, tab or uh, Amazon Fire tablet, then you'll be able to. Um, it's available there for most newer devices, so definitely worth checking out if you're a fan of Star Wars, um, Bejeweled, Candy Crush, and you want a more. Um, 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 or it's like more sci-fi and sci-fi related game to play. So, and also before I forget, the game is available for free and it does have in-app purchases. So you did see that uh, pop-up come up. So, um, it's definitely to get into. And if you want to, if there's in-app purchases that you want to consider, that you want to use, then you can do that as well. So, um, worth checking out. It's Star Star Wars. Uh, and what did I call the game already? I already forgot what it was. Um, so the game is Star Wars Puzzle Droids, available for Android and iOS, and available for uh, free in, for Android and iOS. So with that being said, um, that is all for this particular review. So um, if you want to contact me, you can email me at yahoo.com. You can find me on Twitter at PatelN01. This review and all reviews can be found on YouTube at youtube.com slash PatelN01. Um, and then all the links and all of that, subscription links, social media links, and all of that good stuff can be found on the website at PatelN01.com. But that is all for this particular review. Thanks for watching and listening, and until next time.